I'm going to answer one of the most interesting questions in this video. It is short, but you will also wonder when I ask you this question. Why are tires black? Hello and welcome to Dry Spark. This is Bharadwaj and I am talking today about what are tires and why is it black in color and let's discuss this even further in this video so as we already know tires are made up of a compound called rubber now why do people use rubber so rubber is known to be one of the most sustainable materials for tires that's because tires will have to go through a lot of pressure a lot of wear and tear and also they will have to deform and come back to its shape to give you that cushioning and a sweet ride from your car or your bike or anything on wheels. So as a result, manufacturers over 125 years ago decided that rubber would be the suitable compound for this use case and started manufacturing tires from a rubber. But what did they do before that? So as we already know, we would have seen bullockards that will run on wooden wheels. Yes, people were using wooden for wheels because that was the most sustainable material back then and it can be reshaped in any form or size required for the vehicle. Now wooden has a certain characteristics that will not suit for vehicles longevity that starts with the right quality wood cannot deform like tire and give you that cushioning right it will have a hard ride and wood will also have a lot of wear and tear and will not be suitable for a long run as well so as a result manufacturers chose the rubber so all these factors led to manufacturers rethinking or reinventing not the wheel but the tires that go on it now tires will have to go through a lot of temperature pressure and also wear and tear that i already told you that's because the tire is the end contact patch that is between you and the vehicle and also the road surface now tires when they uh, run on the road they will gain a lot of temperature because of the revolutions that it gains over the period of distance and also it will Will have to handle a lot of pressure because of the turning forces or the g-forces that will be present on the wheel now tires will also have to deal with all the potholes bumps and rough road surfaces to give you that comfortable ride now that is the reason rubber is known to be the most suitable material to start with to build the tires however let me get back to the question why are tires black so the rubber compound that is used in tires is generally very soft and it is also in milky white color however using that untreated or natural rubber on tire will not be sufficient to take up all the cornering forces or the temperature or the air pressure that is built from the load of the vehicle and also the road surfaces that is the reason manufacturers add a supplement agent called as carbon black da -da -da -da, that is the reason why tires are black the carbon black is a chemical material that is completely black in color and when it mixes with the white rubber that is present during the manufacturing process it gives the tire that black color now why is carbon black added so carbon black is an agent as i told you earlier it is a supplement agent which is mixed with the natural rubber once they mix it the carbon black gives the tire that strength that is required to handle high pressure and also to reject the rise in temperature because carbon as we know already is one of the most strongest material present on earth and it works well with the rise or decrease in temperature because it can throw away heat and finally the carbon black also gives the sidewall of the tire the strength to keep its form in shape while deforming on potholes and bumps and also rough roads however if you are an auto enthusiast or if you come across a white tire on cars or bikes there is something called as white wall tires that is being manufactured till date across the world now what are these white wall tires are simply that the normal tire has been uh, manufactured in such a way that the wall of the tire is white in color however the entire tire is completely black still and the color is actually laid on top of it now coming back to the last segment of this video what are the advancements that have taken place in terms of tire life or even tire manufacturing right now the whole world is looking at a ev based uh, tire so for evs you need tires with lesser rolling resistance so that means probably little less use of uh, carbon black and also the tread surface that is there on the tire will also be a little more easier and not so block pattern as you see on the ic cars next the tire industry is also looking a permanent answer for punctures as we already know we have been there we have done that we have changed our step knee however in the near future we can be sure that there are tires coming up which will run flat 
and also will not face any punctures. Now this is achieved where the surface of the tire and the side wall that is there on the tire will be uh, constructed using a mesh pattern to give it that deformation shape and also uh, for the grip that is required on the tire surface. Now these are all the advancements that is going on in the tire industry. What did you think about this video? Do let us know in the comments below and if you have any questions or any uh, opinions of yours please do drop them in the comments below as well. Like and share this video and subscribe to Dry Spark if you haven't done it already. This is Bardwat signing off. Stay safe and ride safe.